All right. Good Saturday, everybody. We have uh, some snow underway in a lot of the northern counties in um, north, uh, western, eastern Pennsylvania, northwestern Jersey. I'm sitting in Morristown, which is the center part of uh, North Jersey, and we got about, um, I would say, a solid half an inch right now. And I'll actually show you. This is outside my my kitchen window, and you could see a good half inch. So the roads actually have gotten pretty coated pretty quick because it's been cold out, and they haven't really treated them around here. So there's been a few accidents in town. Uh, you see these two people. Have to be careful because this this has a big hill in the back of my house, and the amount of times I've slid down this hill uh, when it snows is it's it's pretty funny. But uh, in any event, let's get back to the weather here. Um, this will change to rain. I know it looks like it's we're getting we're in un, a big snowstorm is underway, but it will change to rain. And a big reason is because the low pressure centers to our west, so all warm air is going to be coming into the region as the day progresses. If you look at the current observations, this this blue. Start of the blue line is temperatures at uh, 5,000 feet. Uh, and you could see two hours ago, those temperatures were further south, not are advancing northward. Um, and if I look at one more thing here, guys, if I look at thickness levels, which basically shows you the different layers of the atmosphere and um, basically where the warm air is moving. This green line is from, from basically 1,000 millibars or close to the surface up to 700 millibars in the atmosphere. So it shows that this level here uh, usually is the, one of the best predictors of the rain snow line and you could see two hours ago that green line was all the way down near Delaware and then at one o'clock it advanced pretty rapidly north um, into the New Jersey area, so, uh, the North Jersey area. So this indicates to me that, that the storm is on track in terms of bringing in the warm air so this will change to ice, sleet and then plain rain. Up here in Vermont uh, they're gonna have more snow, they, they're gonna get over six inches up in the mountains absolutely but they too are gonna see some frozen precipitation and rain uh, from this storm, but they're going to have a little bit more of a snowstorm compared to everybody who lives down here. Up in Maine, uh, interior Maine is going to do pretty well with this, so we'll get some nice accumulating snow. And then next week, um, I don't have it on here, but it's going to get brutally cold next week, so um, I don't know if I want to bring it up here. I don't have it, but uh, winter's really going to be upon us, and the temperatures, I mean, some days might struggle to hit 25 degrees in a lot of areas. Up here, I think the forecasted uh, temperatures for Thursday morning in all these areas here from 5 to 10 degrees, so it's going to be very impressive. Um, anytime you get a lot of cold air, you do have to look for snow. The pattern's not perfect, like I said yesterday, but um, we'll have to see after we get through this next week how things evolve. But don't forget, we got a clipper system coming through um, around Tuesday, so we might get a few quick inches of light, fluffy snow uh, on Tuesday night for a lot of areas. But that's all for now, guys. Thanks for checking in.